Sir. Yes. Why would you want to poison your own daughter? Officer, that is not even the problem. Okay, what's the problem? I interviewed the second person. It's not all about cooking. It's all about loyalty. Are you a loyal person? Yes, I'm very loyal, sir. Very loyal? Yes, sir. Can you keep secrets? I can keep secrets very well, sir. Are you very sure? I'm good at keeping secrets, sir. All right. Can you poison my daughter? Yes. If I ask you to poison my daughter, will you? Okay. If that's what you want, sir, I'll poison her. Sure. Yes. Good. Now. A delicious meal. Okay? I'm poison it. Did you hear me? Poison it. Yes, sir. That's good. Don't eat it. Your father asked me to poison the food. Jesus! But my conscience will not allow me to let you eat it. Please don't eat it. Me fool. So my father asked you to poison me and you're spilling it out. Do you know that this is a test? You think so is a wine? In fact, eh, you cannot keep secrets. You cannot be loyal to this family. We can't employ you. You don't have a future here. Yes. You're a nincom poop. It was just a taste. It was a fake poison. It's not real. Chai! Just some things I just put in your distance for you to test your loyalty. And able to keep secret of this family. And you just peel out the whole thing. Get out. Please leave, 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 leave this Get house. Get out. Okay, but this story has nothing to do with this young man you asked us to arrest. What does it have to do with him? You see, yeah. the next day, I interviewed this idiot. You said you can cook very well. Are you really very sure? Okay. Being a good cook goes with absolute loyalty. Are you a loyal person? Yes, sir. Then, can you keep secret? Okay. Now, can you poison my daughter to death? Jesus! Can you do that? Can you? I'm asking you again. Can you? Because this is the criteria for your employment. Can you do that? Yes, sir. You can. Yes, sir. All right. Now, take this poison, put it in her food. That particular portion she will be taking. By the time she eats it half, she'll be dead. And whatever I tell people is the cause of her death stands. Can you keep it as a secret? Yes. Good. In that case, You've got the job. Uh, uh, Sawit, what in this story warrants his arrest? He hasn't done anything wrong. When he brought the food, A few 
moments later. It's very good. It's good. It's very tasty. Mm. Dad. Hmm? I like this one. Oh. Ah, the food is so nice though. Okay. And we are employing him. That's good. He's very loyal. He didn't say anything. That, that's good. That's good. Whatever you say, is what I will do. Our new chef! Are finished. What is remaining now is uh, fried rice. Oh, that's nice. You gave me some. Okay, sir. Yes. I've heard your story, but there is nothing in it to warrant this man's arrest. Officer, uh -huh. as we are talking here now, my my daughter is battling for her life in the hospital. How? After he brought the second food. Bring water, bring water, bring water, bring water, God, bring water. My daughter is talking. What? Sorry, 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 sorry. Bring water, bring water. She's talking. Wait, 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 wait. Everybody, just hold on a minute. I thought you said it was a fake poison. Officer, it was a fake poison. Uh huh. It was a fake poison I gave to this idiot to uh -huh. test his loyalty. Just to test his loyalty. You think they were wise? Come, young man. What happened? No, it's that time that you give me poison. Let me use it and poison in Pekin. Continue. Then the person did not nah, nah, work. And I said, no, I don't want to lose my job. Oh. Let my job, nah. let my organ nah, not say that I did not kill in Pekin for him. Oh. And I go inside the kitchen and I look, 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 look. And I say rat poison. This rat poison can kill in Pekin, and I carry the rat poison, and I put it in, in Pekin food. Yeah, Jesus! Fast. <laughs> <laughs> <Is that> you? <laughs> Young man, you're under arrest. Sir, I put the poison where well, well, I kill her. <laughs> she will die. Don't worry, she will die. So I don't want to lose my job, please. She will die. <laughs> Sir, that rat poison that I put in, in food now, that hospital that I have carried and go, she will not survive, she will die. Sir, please, I don't want to lose my job. Sir, please, promise I'll kill your daughter for you. If she don't die in that hospital now, me, I'll go myself, I'll go and carry this knife and chuka. She will die. <laughs> Sir, please, don't, don't sack me now, please. He sack you! <laughs> please, please, I'll kill her for you, yeah? I'll make you cry. If you have another daughter, I will kill him. This man, you're a lunatic. You're a lunatic. Thank you. How did you know? <laughs> I think I tell you, you have, you have seen it. I, that, that one, I, I did not study it in school, oh. <laughs> it's just working for me. You know, I think something is just working for me. It's something that is doing me natural. It's working for you. Shoot this man in his leg. <laughs> <laughs> This place is hot. My friend, will you remove that cap or you turn it well? In fact, remove it! Remove it! My friend, will you remove that thing from my table? <laughs> um, 
Mr. McAngel. Sir? I'm looking at your CV and I can't find any educational background. What is your academic status? I don't have my own statue. It's our village people that have the statue. <laughs> but it's all of us that have it in our village. Mr. McAngel, hmm? do you have any working experience? Working experience? Ha. Sir? Don't go there. That one. Me, I'm champion. See, eh? I, it's trek that I trek and come here. I don't use to enter taxi. It's work that I used to work everywhere I go. I have plenty of working experience. They used to call me Wakadupe in my compound. I used to work about too much. Oh. It's enough. It's enough. Do you have an account? Yes. Savings or current? In Facebook. No, a bank account. Yes. I have had Senate Bank in my Facebook account. Do you operate with a bank? Like where you save money? No. Is it not a person that have money that will save it? I don't have money. Oh. I'm not doing that one now. But can you deposit money in an account? I mean, if given money, can you deposit it in an account? Can you put money in a bank account? I can do that one. Is it not to carry money and go to bank and put it inside there? I can do it, but I don't have money. Don't, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Mm. Okay, Mr. McAngel, this position is for an office assistant. No other person showed up for the interview, so I guess you, you have the job. You mean I win this job? Yes. Chiliki, <laughs> thank you. God will bless you. Immediately I enter inside here. I know that I'm going to win this job. <laughs> thank you so much. God will bless you. You see this job that you people have given me? I will not disappoint you. You will hey, see. Mr. Bakangel, is enough. This is an office. Respect yourself. Okay? Mm. Um, okay. So, what do you want this company to pay you? After I won't start working, you people want to pay me. What do you want as your salary? Oh, salary. You, how much is this company paying you? Are you stupid? <laughs> what kind of stupid hey, person? It's enough, it's enough. It's like this uncle used to get angry too much. Auntie, how much hey, are Hey, Mr. McAngel, hmm? conduct yourself well. This is an office. Okay, anything you people want to pay me, we can start from there. My friend, go to the lobby. Meet the secretary. She will attend to you. I hope I'm not lobbying this job again because I have... Am I lobbying it? <laughs> it's okay. Thank you so much. God will bless you for this job that you people have given me. God bless you. Auntie, you will marry fine husband. God will bless you. Thank you. Hey, yeah. hey, come back here. Take this cap. God will bless you. Hey, come back. Wear it correctly. Wear it correctly. Put it in front. <laughs> Be very careful. You hear me? Okay, sir. God bless you. God bless you. This uncle used to vex too much. Your papa should be careful. Are you sure we're not making a mistake? <laughs> eh, hey, hey. Emanuela. Emanuela. Um, guess what? What? Guess what? Okay, no? I don't know how to guess. Sit down. <laughs> Emanuela. I have get work. <laughs> How? See, I was walking from office to office and I see one gate. Something not tell me to enter inside the gate. As I now go inside, <laughs> they not do me interview. I now win the job. <laughs> wow, that's good though. So tell me, what are you working as? A gate man? Mba. Cleaner? Mm -mm. <laughs> um, um, office. Office. Office ant. Office ant. Mm -mm. Hey, you didn't have ant. Office assignment. Office assignment. Mba, 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 mba. Hey, it's office something. I forget what they employ me, you know. Hey. You and that person that employed you, I pity for the both of you. Office assessment. I have remember it. Office assessment. It's not only office assessment. It's office assassin. <laughs> <laughs> that one is your business. What I know is that they have employed me. Is that they have employed me. And Mama Achukwemeka, they have employed me. I have job now. What of you? Yeah, yeah, son. You people insult me in this place. You will see what I will do you. You people should stop insulting me in this compound. I have job. Hey, I have.
Good job, oh! You people are calling me jobless person. Sir? Yeah, Mr. McKenzie, come in. Sir, I hope there is no problem. No, no problem. Look at this money. Take it to the bank. Deposit it into this client's account, okay? Eh. Hey. That is uh, $30,000. $30,000? Yes. So you have $30,000? Chili, give me. Sir, don't shout. You have $30,000 in this office and you're shouting it. Come on, take this money to the bank and go and deposit it. What's wrong with you? Eh, hey, enough what? Don't mind me, I've not touched dollar before. It's my first time. Okay, this is the person that... Yes, that's yes, the client's play, account. Play, plaza. Plazen Nigeria Limited. Okay, it's the owner of the money. So I've not touched dollar before. Mackenzie, go to the bank, deposit and go home. You can close from there. Eh? Hey. Yes. Sir, please, can you tell the security people, let them escort me and go My to friend, bank. will you go to the bank now? Eh? <laughs> okay, this person, Plaza in Nigeria, I will call him. I will call him when I reach there. Hello? Yeah, my assistant is on the way with the money. He's going to deposit it into the bank now. Mag, good afternoon. Mm. You saw you closed early. I'll they sack you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking now. How was work? It was fine. Eh, hey, Emanela, do you know that now nah, it's me and dollar that is not doing things? Eh? Hey, yes. You now have dollar? <laughs> Plenty dollar. Wow. Where is it? Eh, hey, don't worry. I will surprise you. <laughs> I have dollar. And I have dollar. Is this how you dress to work? Eh? Hey. I think I make sense. Come on. What do you people used to do in that your company? Is it waste management? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. My own is. They used to send me to go message in the company. Okay. You are the company's house boy. I think you are a start now. Hello? Mackenzie, I sent you to pay money into a client's account and you did not do it. Why is this, Kwanu? Mackenzie, this is your boss. Hey, who? It's my boss, oh. Okay, good evening, sir. Mackenzie, did you pay that money into that account? Is it the money you say I should pay bank? Yes. I pay it now. But the client said they haven't gotten the money yet. Okay, it's like that client is lying, you know. I pay it to her. She was here, I pay it to her. Mark, are you sure you paid this money? Okay. I cannot come and go and start lying to you now. I pay it to her. Okay, you know what? Maybe it's network. See you on uh, Monday. Have a great weekend. Okay, sir. See you. Bye-bye. I pay it. Mr. Mark, I want you to look me in the eyes and tell me the truth. Did you pay in the money that day? Yes, I really paid that money in bank that day. This is not a joke, oh! Mm. Mackenzie, you can go to jail for this. This is not a joke. Mm, God forbid. It's not a matter of go. God forbid. Mr. Mack. Tell us the truth. Did you pay in that? I don't like this uncle. <laughs> He's always finding him face. He's wicked. Mr. McKenzie. Hmm? Before I say anything, I want to let you know that the police are on their way. Mm -hmm. The EFCC are on their way. Mm. The DSS are on their way. Mm. The FBI are on their way. Mm -hmm. NYSE are on their way. <laughs> are not are on their way. So save us time and tell us what you did with our money. Sir, I paid our money in the bank. I paid it inside bank. You paid it in the bank. Mm. The client did not get the money, 
the bank has no record of you paying in that money. Sir, that bank, those clients. Okay, let them swear now that I did not. Look pay here, them my that. friend. We are not playing with you. What did you do with our money? Sir, this uncle is wicked. My friend, this is not a joke. <laughs> Mr. Mark, explain to us how did you pay the money into the bank? Auntie, I will not lie to you. I come here. And I give me the money. Yes. And I tell him, let him give me security people. Let them follow me. Uh -huh. And I tell me, my friend, get away from here. Then, and I get away from here. Uh -huh. Then, and I use my hand. And I was protecting the money. I even use my hand and buy what I prove and put it inside. Then, and I look left, look right. I did not see anybody. And I start walking fast. I was not walking, I was looking around to see whether anybody is following me. And I go to gate side and I see one man. He's looking like thief. Uh -uh. What is it? Why are you looking like that? Are you okay? Come here, what are you holding? Come here! 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 Why are you running? Why are you running? I'm going bank. You're going to bank? That's why you're running. I even thought you a thief. Hi! You're running because you're going to bank. Okay. As he was pushing me around where, where he did not catch me. My man is a thief, really. <laughs> Anna, go to where bank people is staying. Then Anna enter the bank. The bank now start going. Then, as the bank is now going, 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 going. Anna say no. This bank man is looking at my money where well. And I hide the money. He's not looking at me. And I stop him. And I come down from the back. And I tell him I'm not doing it again. Then I look around. Nobody's looking at me. And I bring out the money and see that nobody have thieved the money. Then and I cross my road. And I follow up your way. And I follow Bush side. And I reach the bank. Keke even nearly jammed me. Then and I enter the bank. Okay, uh -huh. So what now happened? Speak up now, Mr. Max. Speak up. I have a confession to make. <laughs> when I enter the bank, and I look around, and I see plenty of people in the bank, but I don't know which one is the client. So I called that number that you gave me, but they said the number does not exist. Which, which number? number? That number that you wrote on that paper and says the client number. Hey! <laughs> Jesus. Okay, Mr. Mark. What happened to the money? Did you take it back home? As the number did not go, and I see where people are paying their own money, then I now carry the money and now go there to go and pay the money. But as I reached there and now open the money and give it to the auntie, the auntie now asked me, Where is your teller? Where is your teller? I don't have that one. You have to fill a teller before handing me this money. Okay, do you know what to do? Take back this money. Go there. Pick up a teller, fill it, then bring the money. Eh? Yes. Then I now go to the place that she said I should go. And I see a person that is writing something there. Me, I don't know what they are writing in the bank. It's like if you don't write it, they will not collect the money. So I now look at what the auntie is writing. And I write what the auntie is writing. <laughs> mm, I swear, I write exactly what the auntie is writing. I did not make a mistake. That's how I now pay the money in the bank. Hey! Hey! Oh Jesus, so I knew it. You mean you copied someone's account number and gave that person our money? No. I did not pay the person our money. I paid the money in the bank. Hey! This guy is a lunatic. I knew it. Okay, that is my calling, but is there a problem? <laughs> <laughs>